Good morning everyone, I'm Melody from Big Leg and Let's Dig It. And I did a video on how I single stem my tomatoes. Um, and I did say that I would do a video on suckers. What's a sucker? Here's a tomato plant. I'll try to show you the best that I can. A sucker, this is the main... Oh, I hope that you can see this. Hold on, let's see if I can adjust you folks. Hang tight. Okay, let me put it this way. This is the main stem to the tomato plant. Then you have the branches that come out on each side. When you go in the middle, like when you go to the branch, hopefully my hand's not in the way. I call it the armpit right in between the crease. Can you see that? I'm wiggling it. That right there is a sucker. You just take your fingers, you pinch it out. Uh, some people put these in water to get a root. Some you'll get will be pretty big. Some people just stick these in the dirt. I haven't had success doing that. But a sucker takes away from the tomato plant. So basically you just, here's a little itty bitty baby one right there. They're usually in the creases. Here's a stem right here, the stem right there. Right in the armpit, as I like to call it, you will find suckers. And you wanna just pinch them off Here's one that is a little bit bigger. Let me hope I can get it for you. Here's a stem to a tomato right here. And then if you look right here, in between, as I call the armpit, is a bigger one. You just pinch it off. If you let them get too big, you may have to use scissors or something, but it's well advised to take all the suckers off your tomato plants for a lot more success. Um, here we go, prime example right here. This is the stem of the tomato plant right there, follow it up. See this, this is the bottom branch. In between that is a really big sucker. Let's see if I can get it all, pinch it. There's a big sucker. So you can get little teeny ones. You can get pretty big ones. And they will always be in between the little nooks. Sorry, I'm not even wearing gloves. My fingers are filthy. Um, it'll be right in between. And there like, is where you will find it. I call it the armpit. And you just go around every day and make sure you get the suckers off. Let's see if I could find some more that's a little baby one uh, let's keep looking i'll try to show you some more i'm working on um my tomato plants today let's see if i can find us a good sucker show you one more time sorry if i'm bouncing your rounds okay we have this plant follow the stem this is a branch this is probably going to end up eventually coming off because in my previous video, I talked about blight. You don't want your leaves being on the dirt, touching your mulch, whatever it may be. Okay, here's a branch. In between the branch right there is a sucker. And you just pull it off. Um, so yeah, here's another one. It's a little tiny. It will usually be in between the branches. Like here's your branch, it would be right in there. There's a little teeny tiny one. So just pick that off. And that is where you find your suckers. Um, I have to tie this one up still. Um, you don't want the suckers on there because it takes away from the plant itself. And um, I mean, if you were to break a branch, you could leave a sucker, it would be fine. But technically you want to get all the suckers off in between so your plant does much better and produces more tomatoes and while i'm here i'm gonna pinch this off because this is touching the grounds um, i showed that in a video how i prune my tomatoes and that is to make sure you get all the lower leaves off um so yeah you just basically want to look in between your stems and i don't have this one tied up yet i will tie it like this, which I'm gonna do a video on how I tie mine. Um, but yeah, this is a sucker video. So let's see. 
if we could find some more suckers. Let me see if I can find one more to help you all out so that the newbie gardeners will know what to look for when it comes to sucker. I have a couple that are so bent because they weren't staked. Um, let me look in here. Okay. Branch in between it. Sucker. Just pinch it off. Um, I don't really see anymore. But you kind of want to stay on top of the suckers. Because then they will get really big. And just be a little too much. So they could be as small as this. It's a sucker. Or they could be pretty big. Um, let me see if I can get a better shot. <sighs> okay, let's go with this one. Just let me see if I can find you a flat spot. When I say that, it's usually because I'm using my tripod to draw on my mulch. It's in between my, my rows. And sometimes it'll tilt. This is the tomato plant. Let me bend you down a little bit. Or up, I should say. This is a tomato plant I'm working on pruning and staking it. Here's the only thing I've noticed thus far with using, this is my first year using bamboo. Um, they won't always be straight. Okay, so this one was left and it's kind of Just got stalked up. I have to pin it up in another place. Here is the stem. And right there in the middle, hopefully you can see that, is a little itty bitty sucker. So you just go in and you just pinch it out. And then right here, let me show you again. I found another one. This is your main stem. This is your branch. And right there, is a sucker you just pinch it out so yeah if you're new with tomatoes don't do what i did right now and that gets so busy to where i didn't even have them tied up yet so i'm a little bit behind and now i'm going through and checking for all the suckers um like i said they'll be in the armpit of the uh, tomato plant and you want to just remove them uh, let me just see this one. This one over here just is a little baby one. Just like nothing. But it's kind of better to get them now before they get too big. Here's a pretty good one. Let's see if I could show you all this. Okay, here's my tomato plant. You can see the stem. Hopefully. And then right there, this is your stem. That's your branch. And then right there in the middle is a sucker. So that's basically all you would do is just go in between each of the branches. I call them armpits and just look for any suckers and take them out. Your plant will overall be more healthier and uh, yeah, the plant will productively grow better as well. Like. There is a good size sucker. So that's usually what I do is steak first, um, take out all the suckers and prune. I'm behind schedule. So much rain going on. Um, so that's what I'm working on. It's this first bed. Some of them look a little twisted because they are. Um, they were flopped over from the rain and I am trying to get them staked up. This is what the bamboo is looking like. Um, you know, like this it's not even straight that's just how some of them are but we'll try it out this year and i'll give you an honest review at the end of the season but today's video is on suckers so make sure you i did do a video on pruning and this video is on removing all the suckers from your tomato plants and then maybe i'll do a video bringing you along on how i stake my tomatoes so I hope that was helpful for you. Just go through your tomato plants. Look in the crease of the arm, which would be like this branch right here. Look in there. 
and that's where you will find your suckers. So I hope that was helpful. Um, I hope everyone, I know this rains a bit much, but got to stay on top of things or they just get completely out of hand. Um, but I hope that was helpful. Love you guys. Leave me a comment and uh, subscribe if you have not already. And I will see you on the next video.